I'm the first person in class today, although I thought, think I'm a little too early. Then again, sitting alone here for 20 minutes sure beats having to suffer at time with Kenji. The combination of fatigue, frustration, and boredom starts making me feel very tired. I black out for a second, waking up with when my head hits the surface of my desk. Rubbing my forehead, I realize that this is as good a reason as any to stay up for now and stop coming to class so early later. Eventually, I hear a tapping noise outside in the hallway, and Lily's tall figure appears in the doorway. She's not in this class, so she must have some other business. Maybe she's looking for Annika. Lily stops at the door, looking hesitant as if she was a vampire who can't come in unless invited. Oh yeah, that thing. I consider doing some bit doing so because she looks rather lonesome standing there. She steps in on her own accord though, after straightening her skirt and shirt collar as if it was of importance to look prim when entering our classroom. Excuse me. She calls to the quiet classroom with a probing, delicate voice. I realize the si silence might unnerve her because of her blindness, so I break it. Good morning, Lily. Miss Al, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I didn't hear you. Come in. Whenever she thinks it's suspicious, I didn't say anything to her before. It's likely. If I were to tell her tell too big a lie now, it would sink me. Well, I was already here, just asleep until now. Oh, have you seen Hanako today by any chance? No, she seems to come in only just before the bell rings, or after that. Do you want me to tell her something for you? No, it's fine. It's strange, but I think we're the only two people in the school right now. I didn't hear anything else on my way here. I shouldn't have gotten up so early today, I guess. You're chastising yourself for doing something that other people should? Punctuation is a good thing, I think so anyway. It's a very busy morning today. The festival is coming up soon, and today is the deadline for event registration, budget reports, and any other official paperwork. I would do horrible in Japan <laughs> with all this stuff. I'd be like the worst person to ask for help. I'm not good at lifting stuff, I have bad stamina for running, and I have bad at coordinating anything. It'd be that everyone is trying to complete the necessary forms at the last minute. Maybe that is why it's so quiet today. Huh. Misha. Hi, hi, Puffy, I'm you, Misha. Misha pops into the room with uh, Shizune as if on cue. Shouting with a loudness that makes Lily visibly flinch. Loud noises. Hi, Nichan. Hi. Look, it's the class representative. Hello. Lily smiles, pro probably amused by Misha's or Shizune's use of the word look. Oh, you're mean. Good morning. Of course, you're not the representative of this class, right? Right? I'm not. Man, you guys are dicks to her. Like, seriously. Or if you're not trying to be, you're still acting it's in my bit, in my opinion, they are. At least seems a little bit more guarded in her answers to Zune than she was with me the other day. I guess they really don't get along at all. Now I realize that Lily might actually not know Shizune is present, and she's trying to detect whether or not she is, to know who she is talking to. For all that, all she knows, she's talking to Misha, but knowing that she and Shizune are practically inseparable, she might expect Shizune being the one that's actually talking. Damn how complicated. I decided to help Lily out, for my own pe peace of mind more than anything else. You're here early, Shizune. You were here earlier than us. Misha puffs out her chest angrily. <laughs> Why is she getting angry? Does she feel emotions on Shizune's behalf too? 
It's not that weird, though, that Shizune didn't like my little comment. It's true. I was here earlier than them. So me saying something like like that would definitely be misinterpreted as an, as anything. Especially to Suzune, who doesn't have the benefit of hearing tone of hearing tone to gosh intent. Before I can start with weighing whether or not I could apologize, Shizune has already moved on. Class rap It's a good thing you're here. We have to talk. The vessel is coming up in three days, right? Every other class has already handed in their project, projected budget reports for their events. Even a first use. Except you! There is still time to ha hand it in, isn't there? Today. The deadline is today. You're certainly taking your time, aren't you? If I had it my way, I'd have had all the necessary paperwork done days ago, but someone had to say the deadline, please extend it. I don't like Shizune. I don't like her. You are bad. You are a bad girl. I hate you. Yes, that was me. Planning something on the scale is not a small task, and a week is too sm too small a time frame to expect a whole class to work out such a complex issue completely. Seriously, I side with Lily on this. You guys are jerks. Do you want to know what's harder than distinct distributing the funds for one class's event, handling the same matter for every class in the school, and then some. The one who do does that is me. Misha puts her hands on her hips and stands up straight. Wow, she's really getting into the role. Lily doesn't look like she's very amused, though. Hey, Shizune, aren't you being a little too hard on her? There's a whole day left. Please, Sisao, it's all right. Lily really seems happy I'm tra taking her side. Heck yeah, take her side! Oh my gosh, I would help you. I'll be helping Lily more than uh, if Lily was the per person that took care care of the like student council. I'll join. I would, cause she's in charge, not you. Like, oh my gosh, why does anyone go for her? She's so mean, arrogant, dang. Lily seems happy I'm taking her side, but a bit conflicted that I might not think she could take care of herself. If it is about the budget, then I'm disappoint dis I'm disappointed you think I have forgotten about it. I understand how important it is. The heck is that? Is that an error? Oh wait, that's her oh okay. Then can I have it please? Shizune she might not have it on her at this exact second. It's not here right now. I asked you to students to take care of it for me. Students from my class. She emphasizes the last sentence much to my surprise. She knows about Suzune and Misha's efforts to rope me into the student council. I guess word must have gotten around. So now she's using me as ammo against Shizune. This just got better and better. It was your responsibility. A budget report isn't something you... She's blind! She's blind! You're telling her to make a report on budget when she is blind! What the actual F? <laughs> is it something you should just take... Oh my god. Ugh. As class rep, it's your job to be on top of things. This kind of disregard for proper procedure is just... You have eyes, at least, that can see. Shut up. They, compl they completed it, being c capable of doing so. But the See, she needs people to write stuff down for her. But the students... I'm getting way too into this. But the students have been sick recently, so they could not come to school and give it to back to me. If he wants, I apologize on their, their behalf for getting sick. Yeah, you're all getting to Zane's face. Okay. Although Misha misses Lily's little jab entirely, and Shizune doesn't. And she seems torn between being offended by Lily's daring and jumping for joy at the prospect of a challenge. Challenge accepted. 
That's gone. So yeah, it was a visual error because um, when I when I was looking for a second, when I paused for a second, I looked and I saw like a little um book. I thought it was a tear or something. I'm not or like a sweat, but it's not there again. So, but it doesn't. Lily, don't they live here at the school? It's a five minute walk, you know. What could they possibly have that prevents them from taking five minutes out of their busy lives? They drop off something that will affect the enjoyment of their entire class. Lily opens her mouth to say something, but she suddenly closes the gap between them and starts signing furiously, waving her hands around like an orchestra conductor. Misha tries her best to convey the same passion, but can't seem to lose her normal cheerful tone. The result is interesting and somewhat surreal. And what's with that attitude? I said that it's not something you should be delegating anyway. Are you the class representative or not? Aren't you? Tell me the names of these two students. They should have their your job if you can't even handle something. Okay. Here's something I normally don't do. If you guys have noticed in my videos, I have never, never want, for some reason... In my mind, I cannot say the F word. I like to say, F and that's it. Or fook. I never say the, or like the full on word. I never do. I never do unless it's like serious. But fuck you, Shizune. Okay, I'm, okay, that's all. I, that's all I had to go through. I'm sorry. I am bleeping that out. But oh my gosh. I know people like this. I understand what everyone's going through when they know somebody who's power hungry little b who go goes around thinking they're the best side dish in the entire world. Like, oh my god, this is ah, this is like bringing back bad memories. One form it isn't the full extent of what I am supposed to take care of. Lily's tone is gr growing slightly impatient, but she's doing a good job of not letting Shizune see her unsettled un she is becoming. She's playing her cards close to her chest. Heck yeah, go Lily! Shizune, on the other hand, wraps her fingers cheerfully around the edge of her glasses, knowing Lily can neither hear nor see how excited she is. Okay, something's going on with my computer or something, I don't know. Of course, you do so much, class rep. It must be difficult being you. Lily tightens her lips at Misha's words, clearly understanding the intent behind them, even though Misha delivers them without even a hint of the sarcasm which they were meant to have. Shizune and Lily doesn't li don't like each other. As much is clear, but it seems a little much. It seems like Lily ha has had enough and is ready to push back. I was actually just discussing the budget report before you came by. You must be very talented to have finished all your student council duties so quickly that you can track me down to make sure I don't forget my own. Are you accusing him? Oh my gosh, I like this. Oh, man. Excuse me of slacking off. It seems like you're confused with me yourself. I don't think so. That would be a very difficult thing to do for me to do, comparing myself to you. You're right. The difference between us is like heaven and hell, and it's no—it's not hard to guess which one of you might represent. Put your skirt down, Shizune. No one wants to see that. The air between there then ripples the heat of their enmity. Well, not really. They can't disguise it anymore, though. Even Misha looks like she's beginning to understand the real nature of this conversation. He is like, do 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 do
smoothly than this person. You, Shizune. I don't understand why. Don't drag me into this. I've done my part. Actually, you know what? Lily has been getting a lot of bull from you, and so have I. Cut to respect. Hey, I'm a new guy, you remember? It's not like I could have done much, even if I wanted. That's right. You shouldn't expect the transfer student to jump right into this on his first week. Lily taking my side feels oddly comforting, so I decided to back her up too. Yeah, you're being unreasonable with us both. Excuse his excuses. Miss Class Rep has had plenty of time to deal with her report, and we repeatedly offered you a position to help with the student count... Council work, but you refuse to commit yourself to making the festival a success. Yeah, but as I said before, I'm not sure if I don't have time for this right now. No matter what I do, it will mean be being dragged into a confrontation with Zuni, and that is what she wants. Whatever. Forget it. I turn my back on them. Lily, class is going to be starting soon, so we can talk more later. I'll tell Hanako you were looking for her. I can feel Shizune freezing. Maybe this is the first time she has ever been ignored in such a blunt manner. Thank you, Hasao. I'll leave now, then. She gives me a, the sweetest smile I've seen all week. And I turn on her and turns on her heels to make her exit. As soon as I, Lily walks out the door, I suddenly start feeling feeling reluctant about turning to face Shizune. I can feel her eyes burning into my back, and c can't bring myself to look at her. She must be furious. I keep expecting Misha to say something to uh, alleviate the tension, but it really is wanting too much. In the end, I go back to my seat and listen to the sound of Shizune's footsteps as she marches out of the room. She doesn't return until a few minutes before class. Okay, guys, I'm gonna have to end the episode here. I. Oh my. Man. See, I got back to I can't say it, but like, oh my gosh, I never do unless I really do not like somebody. Oh my god, I do not like Shizune right now. So, I. Oh uh, man. I'm going to have to end the episode here. Like and favorite, rejoice. Subscribe to become. Whatever. Uh, my brain hurts. Like, uh. Subscribe for more videos later. Uh, also, I'd like to give a little update that. Um. I'm not sure if I leave a, in the description a, thing, a link to my Twitter, but my Twitter is going to be the thing that's going to be giving updates on what's going on. When I'm not making videos because my discussion tab on my channel is never used it's because no one bothers even going to it. You probably didn't even know I had a discussion part of my channel, did you? Yeah. But, um... Yeah, subscribe subscribe for uh, for updates on, on the videos. And and go to my Twitter. I d normally don't use my face Facebook that much. But if you go to my Twitter, I tend to um, give updates on if I'm able to... Um, make videos or not so i'll see you guys later and save create a new save state continue and fuck you jizune